For Ultimate Team Coins, check out GameGoldTrader.com. Their link is in the description below, a very fast and reliable service. And if you use the discount code NEPO at checkout, you get a discount on your coins. They also offer PSN, MSP, and other Game Gold as well. What's up guys, the Panthers here and welcome back to another episode of the best team in FIFA. Today we are using a very, very interesting team, a, um, a, a viewer and subscriber in the stream that I've been doing. I've been streaming every night if you guys aren't aware, twitch.tv no, twitch slash Nepenthes. Um, yeah, I've been, uh, I've been streaming or twitch.com, I don't remember, it's one or the other. Um, just Twitch slash Nepenthes, just fucking messing things up here, but anyway. Um, he recommended to me a front duo, um, I added the trio and then built a, a team around it. And we played one game in stream and it was phenomenal, so I thought I'd do a the best team in FIFA on the team. This of course is my first owner club, so every player is packed. So if there's not a player that you actually would like, you could obviously go ahead and change the team. But um, yeah, if you can leave a like on the video guys, that would be absolutely awesome. But for now, let's look at the team, kapow! So we have got the front duo of Jermaine Defoe and Thierry Henry. He, um, he's not supposed to be super juiced, I added an attribute card to him when I was opening packs in the stream last night. Um, and when, within the first game for Jermaine Defoe, who, who wasn't super juiced in the first game, he scored five goals. And he scored two goals from about 45 yards out. He was absolutely incredible. We've also got Thierry Henry, who in his four games that he's played for me so far has got four assists and one goal. And we put up Cam, who are also packed uh, Bradley Wright Phillips. So that makes it a really good trio up front. Of course, then we need to we need to give Bradley Wright Phillips a few more links. So I put Walcott right mid, and then I went on and got Richards company, uh, Ramirez, Koscielny, Czech, Ashley Cole, and uh, Eden Hazard. Now, of course, if you prefer someone like David Luiz or maybe Gary Cahill or a team of the season player or something like that in centre-back, um, or maybe uh, Yaya Torre. Who, do I have Yaya Torre? I don't know if I have Yaya Torre. I don't seem to have Yaya Torre. I do have Yaya Torre, but does he give the chemistry like it needs? No, it doesn't. See, I need the, I need that Ramirez card there for um, for the Chelsea link with Hazard. But yeah, so if you guys do want to change some of the players around you, you're more than welcome to. But uh, I just wanted to give this this team a proper try. We're going to go ahead and play five games with it now. I'm going to show you guys the goals, recommend whether or not the team is very good and um, what players specifically you should maybe look to invest in. But for how cheap Defoe is, this third informed Defoe is about 30,000 coins. He is, I, after playing one game with him, I can tell you he is worth 30,000 coins, hands down. He is phenomenal. Well, let's get into the action, guys, and show you the goals and uh, talk about how well this team actually plays. Let's go. Okay, guys, as we get into the gameplay, first of all, apologies for the, the bad audio quality at the start. Or not bad, but the not as usually good audio quality at the start. I had some problems with the USB spot my mic was in, and sometimes it was picking up the, the mic that I use, and sometimes it wasn't. And the times that it wasn't, it was picking up the computer mic, which isn't very good. So sorry about that, but it's been fixed now, uh, so we should have no problems with it going forward. So this team, guys, um, I managed to win three of the five games, um, which was surprising for me I thought it would be a hell of a lot better than it was playing um, obviously I played two games with it on stream as I said at the start and I won them both comfortably and I was very I was very or I was really looking forward to using this team I really really was um, but it was nothing but frustrating in this first game I battered the guy I ended up winning 7-0 he stopped playing at 2-0 um, I went and threw and just scored some goals to pad some stats uh, as you do and um, he ended up rage quitting right at the end but as you can see I've given this uh, attack a 4 star midfield 3 star defence 4 star overall 4 star the 4 one 2 one 2 in this instant I've given a 4 star the best player was hands down Jermaine Defoe and for 320,000 coins I don't recommend this team I've given it 2 star value for money the biggest pro the biggest problem excuse me got hiccups the biggest problem for me um, well, there was there was two massive problems. First of all, the midfield and why I've given it a three star was due to the fact that Bradley Wright Phillips is actually very very bad. He was constantly out of position. He was never involved in the game. His passes were incredibly bad. His like I say, his positioning was very poor. Just in general, he he just got lost in games. And uh, other than pace, he doesn't have any other decent stats, and uh, that was really apparent. The other biggest problem for me, that's why I've given him his midfield a three-star, by the way, because he was essentially non-existent. The other biggest problem for me was, unfortunately, Thierry Henry. Now, obviously, if you guys know, I love Thierry Henry completely. I'm a massive Arsenal fan. He is my favourite player in world football. But he missed so many sitters. He hit the post a couple times. He hit the bar a couple times. And he missed a few absolute bankers. And 
I, I just know for a fact if I had a better striker up front there instead of Thierry Henry, if I had someone with like 82, 83 shooting, if I had someone with a bit more composure, I would have ended up winning the games that I lost and this team would have been a whole, whole lot better. But unfortunately, that wasn't the case. And uh, it was just very frustrating playing with a guy that should be banging goals in and just wasn't. He just, he just, couldn't, he just couldn't score the goals that I really, really wanted him to score. The, here is one that he does score, though. Lovely dance around the defender there and puts it into the back of the net. But unfortunately, it wasn't good enough. The defence I gave four star because uh, even though I even though I only lost uh, lost two of the games, I didn't really concede many goals. Um, but when I did have chances created against me, they did seem to go in a lot more than I could have cared to concede chances. So I was quite disappointed with the defence but it is a very strong defence still I've played you know hundreds of games with this kind of defence in FIFA this year and uh, it, it usually proves very good so before we get to the end of the video if you could leave a like rating on it that would be absolutely fantastic I do appreciate all the support you guys continue to give we are now over 600,000 subscribers which is absolutely insane so leaving a like and a sub would be awesome like I say Bradley Wright Phillips he got two assists in six games in total and uh, that just uh, isn't quite good enough when Ashley Cole is getting the same number of assists. But this is going to be the end of the video, guys. So thank you, as I say, for watching. And I will see you next time. I'm out. Peace. Points to that River Plat plate, plate kit. And um, we've got a duplicate Pogba and Mascherano there. Another duplicate Pogba. Of course, these are all first owner cards, guys. That's the whole point of the first owner club. Uh, Tony Kroos, the 86 Mascherano again. 86 uh, Sanchez. And as you would have seen in the pack opening video the other day, I got...